This is a this is a really good song, so I'm excited. <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome back to the front room. I'm Kai, and I'm here with my dad today, as always. Hi guys, hope you're having a wonderful day. And I'm switching it up on you. Do you know? Uh, oh. In terms of not being hip hop. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna you, get you to. Are you, are you feeling okay? You got a fever? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Well, uh, all I know is it's a good song. It's from it's from 2015, off their album Depression Cherry. This is the cover of the album. Depression Cherry. Oh. Okay. Uh, not a lot to be said about the album cover, maybe. <laughs> no, but that okay. This is exactly. Well, they're obviously making some kind of a statement with mm -hmm. a cover like that, but I don't know what it would be. Mm -hmm. They yeah. they they uh, in an interview they mentioned how mm. they thought that. They're trying to convey a feeling, obviously, with the title, and I think the cover reflects that, and that feeling is pretty vague, mm -hmm. but it's a balance between two sort of opposites, depression and cherry, like a fruit, something yeah. that is sweet, right? Yeah, and you know how we have that expression, um, something with a cherry on top, mm. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so... I, I get that. Yeah. yeah, and whenever I think of the title, I sort of think of someone that is depressed eating a cherry... And it seems like a really weird thing, you know. Well, also, you know, when you think about it, with that cover that's almost blank, I'm not sure, is that the screen of the laptop? Or no, it, it is muddled a little a bit. muddled color, but I guess if one is depressed, the world seems blank or dulled down, mm. simplified into like a one-dimensional plane, almost. And this cover... Um, Kind of expresses that, I think. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Hmm. So that's uh, something that you can sort of expect to see in their music. It, it's funny because with the name Beach House, when you said these guys are called Beach House, I thought, <laughs> okay, it's going to be like the Beach Boys or some very happy, you know, cheerful la di da di da music. Not that I don't. I mean, hey, I like the Beach Boys. Yeah. But um, that's what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. But with a title like Depression Cherry. I have absolutely no idea what to expect here. Here we go. Like that opening melody. It's beautiful. It is. Beautiful. It was late at night. You held on time. From an empty sea, a flash of
love that organ, that deep mm. organ. Lazy percussion, very yeah. that's nice. Uh -huh. I haven't even been looking at the lyrics. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. That's good. You don't need to. You still don't need to for the rest of the song, I'll tell you that. That was a very emotional song. Mm -hmm. I mean, wow. I haven't heard much stuff like that. Very cathartic. Cathartic. Yeah. Wow. That is a vibe. Mellow. Beautiful. I'm using that word that you say I shouldn't use so much. Exquisite. <laughs> That was beautiful. It's okay. It can be your oh, thing. Oh, man. It just takes you away, doesn't it? Space song, right? And that um, melody that keeps coming back in, that motif or whatever you want to call it, it's just mm -hmm. gorgeous. Yeah. That. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. Yeah. Not just gorgeous. pretty, but it just something makes you feel it. something. I know. It makes you feel something. You can't put your finger on it, right? No. And it's so simple, but it's just, um, oh, it's got that haunting beauty, and, and it's really, really nice. Um, <laughs> There's a tissue box over there, I think. Where? Oh, way over there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's just... You know, to hear music that moves you um, is really, really special. Um, and I wouldn't have thought, you're probably surprised that I like this as much as I do, right? I, I because you've played some I ethereal am. stuff for me mm -hmm. once in a while, mm -hmm. a little bit, and I'm usually not all that impressed. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. I think I'm looking for, well, where's the substance to this? But mm -hmm. this had substance but it was also very ethereal and just sort of, um, yeah, it has a pop, definite pop um, overtone to it, doesn't it? Yeah, that's that, that, that pop, uh, dream pop. Dream pop, sort of, sort of right. Thing. That's right. their main, main type of beautiful, music. Beautiful, beautiful. I really, really liked it. Um, and I'm, I would imagine that this uh, genre would appeal to male and female alike. I think so. I think or so. Or let's, let me put it another way in this day and age appeal to anyone mm -hmm. i would hope yeah 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 it's a song that i feel like uh you can listen to by yourself and mm -hmm. it makes you feel like 
you're with someone else almost. Oh, really? Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's about a relationship that's sort of falling apart. Well, I, I know you weren't listening to the lyrics. No, but you I don't I, need to to feel the song. So that's completely fine. I had my eyes closed for most of the song. I think just listening to the the music. Yeah. Gorgeous song. Well, it looks you. like we probably have to do another Beach House song. Is this, does this mean I'm going to be spending my time listening to more, another new genre of music? Maybe. There are some absolutely wonderful albums from this, this type of music. Huh. Yeah. Dream Pop is, is wonderful. And it's really addictive to listen to. <clears throat> I'm surprised that these guys are from the States because um, this, to me, sounds like the type of music that might come out of England or the continent mm. and not the United States. But, uh, hmm. Mm -hmm. so, I guess it's 2015, so, well, they started in 06, but yeah. with the internet, it's a lot easier to get those That's different. That's true, different, isn't it? And it's a lot easier to be different, take a chance to be different, because you can just post it on the internet and stuff like that, right? Yeah, yeah. Nowadays, you have access to music from all over the world, so you're not, mm -hmm. uh, the music you create is not necessarily semi-dictated by your location anymore, right? Seems to be, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful, thanks. My pleasure. I'm really glad you liked it. I wasn't sure how this go, how this would go, yeah. honestly, um, but I'm glad it, it went the way it did, I suppose. Thanks for sharing these moments with us, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Thanks, everybody. See ya. Bye-bye. <laughs> right. <laughs> You know what it was? That melody. That... Oh, it's just like tugged at my heartstrings. It's beautiful. <laughs>